Hey guys, Apple has officially released iOS 11.2.5 Beta 3 to register developers today. For those of you who are developers, you will see this populate on your device under settings and software updates, but public beta testers, it hasn't been pushed out just yet. You can expect it later this afternoon and at the latest maybe tomorrow now when it comes to this software if you're coming from beta 2 to beta 3 are you going to see a 131 megabytes give or take depending on your device and of course the software you're coming from but there is one thing that i noticed it is a new with this software and i'm gonna share that with you guys here in a few seconds but let's go ahead and take a look at the build number here 15d 5049a longer build number usually means more betas are in the pipeline before the official launch of this software the feedback application is still on the springboard so that means this is most likely not the gold master copy and we still have one to two more betas before the official launch of this software so we can probably anticipate it uh, throughout the 15th 16th 17th somewhere around there if not next week we'll have to wait and see what apple will do with these beta releases uh, after this so what is new with this software what is anything if anything is new well take a listen so right here i'm going to go to the uh, phone application and here's an older version of ios let me go ahead and do the dialer here now hear this one Wow, that is really, really, really loud. So let's go ahead and do that again. And system sounds are identical. It's up the whole way. So you get really, really loud system sounds with iOS 11.2.5. I've also noticed that system sounds have been pushed up a notch as well when you lock your device. See how much louder that is? It's really, really loud. Now, also when typing on the keyboard, so there's not a way to kind of bring this down so the sound is relatively loud all the time and it doesn't look like you can adjust the sound yourself on this new version of iOS. So let me know what you think. Kind of interesting that Apple has uh, pretty much bumped up the sound volume on the system sounds, things like locking your device, keyboard inputs, and uh, keypad inputs. So rather interesting. That's pretty much it. Anything else in the software, everything else I should say, uh, remains the same with iOS 11.2.5. And so there you guys have it. I hope you guys enjoy the video and uh, have a great day. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.